Hi, this is Mary Redmond, the Fearless Negotiator. We're in the engage process and we're talking about body language. Today's tip has to do with proximity. Proximity is how close or how far away do you feel comfortable when you communicate with someone? There are a number of differences that people take into consideration when they decide where they're comfortable. Proximity depends upon whether you're a man talking to a man, a woman talking to a woman, a man talking to a woman, and do you know one another well, or have you just been introduced? We also refer to different aspects of proximity as your personal space, or your social space, or the public space. In your personal space, you it assumes you know someone and are very comfortable with them. And you may be 12 inches to two feet apart. You'll often see that with two women who know each other. A couple who are intimately involved will be very comfortable with a six inches, 12 inches apart. Your social space is a whole lot bigger. It's four feet, maybe as far as up to 12 feet. When do you find social space? You're in a public setting, as it's indicated, social. And you're very comfortable with someone, but that's close enough. A foot, 12 feet might even be comfortable. Where do you see this? You often see this between two men. So hey, how about those cheeks? And the body language is not only long way apart, but there will be physical things that manifest the distance between you and them. That your public space is 12 to maybe as far as 25 feet is a comfortable distance. That's where the guys are talking football, maybe at a stadium even, and they're definitely comfortable, but a way big distance apart from one another. I teach body language to a, a group of ladies who are in a home, it's called Sheffield Place. I am very cautious because the residents in Sheffield Place are there because they have either been incarcerated or they have been in a facility for some mental challenges that they might have. They may have been in domestic violence situations. They're, they're very, I'm very careful with them how much distance I keep from them. When I just meet them, I'm usually with them for one hour. When I just meet them, I give them 10 feet, 11 feet. By the end of the class, they've allowed me to shake their hand, maybe even put my hand on their shoulder. But the difference is I've taken time to get to know them and they've known me. Proximity drives a lot of successful relationships when you are aware of it. That's it from the Fearless Negotiator. If you don't ask, you don't get.